Hello friends, welcome to my channel Art Spectacle. Today we will be learning uh, how to draw this beautiful mushroom. Um, you can draw it in your sketchbook like I have done or your art journal. So let's get started. So um, at first I am going to draw an outline of mushroom. I am using a micron pen for that but before that I have just like outlined with pencil. And as you can see the shapes are uh, resembling like a mushroom. I have also made uh, a few smaller mushrooms to give it more of a natural look. So you can do that too. Uh, once I am finished with the outline, I will uh, first paint the background. As you can see I have taken a green color and I will mix some blue as well to it to give it um, a light background color which would be contrasting to the mushroom colors that I'm gonna paint and the mushroom would be in red and white so um, this would be a good highlighting color for the overall picture the exact color details I will put in the description box so make sure you check that out with the green and blue I have also taken some brown and um, made color of soil and also painting some of the mushrooms with the same color and um, the lower part of the mushroom is also kind of a brownish tint so I'm using the same color mix it with a little bit of white and um, painting over that as well we don't have to be very specific with the colors because this is kind of a doodle so you can use the colors you want and whatever pleases your eyes. So while painting the big mushroom, I'm making sure that I leave some white spaces in between to give it uh, a shadow or highlight you can say. This looks um, kind of how actual mushroom looks like. So I'm just doing some detailing on it. Okay, time to start with the uh, red mushroom and I have taken the red leaving the spaces for the white area and just going over it. I think I'll need two or three coats of the same paint to achieve the finished look. So again painting the second mushroom with the same uh, red color. This is actually vermilion hue and if we paint um, two or three layers of the color it gives a very vibrant look. And uh, from the first coat, I will be able to understand how many coats it would take. So you can make it based on uh, how you like it. And um, as you can see, after the second coat, I'm liking the color and it is looking more vibrant. So I will continue doing that. After I finish, I'll see if it needs one more coat. So far, it looks good. I'm just highlighting the blank spaces um, so to highlight I have added a little bit of black to the same red color and it would give the illusion of a little elevated area so the trick is we have to create shadows and do highlights to give the elevation effect and repeat the same process for the other mushroom also if you notice the blank spaces that I have left over the mushroom uh, that is not of a specific shape for the first one and the one behind it is circular so you can choose whatever you like and make it like that. As you can see after the highlight in the white space it is looking now more natural and the look is coming together. I will just repeat the same step for the other mushroom one more coat of brown in the areas it is required basically a do a finishing touch and at this point i would like to say that i hope you are enjoying my video if you have any suggestions please feel free to uh, let me know in the comment section this is a new channel that i have started and and your feedback is really appreciated also if you have any suggestion for what i should paint next please let me know all right so back to the painting uh, as you can see, I'm just doing the finishing touch just right now, adding red to the flower, green to the grass and browns to the small mushrooms and wherever I see that it needs one more coat or um, I can do some shading somewhere, I'm just doing that. Lastly, I'm adding one more 
layer of paint to the background and with that I think I pretty much like the final look as you can see the blue is giving good contrast to the vibrant red color also the brown mushroom is giving it balanced look I really hope you like it please do like share and subscribe